The promise of 3D printing is that everyone can create just about anything, right? 3D printed high heels? Yep. We're now printing everything from catwalk accessories to the silver screen superheroes. But what about the more down to earth world? This is a 3D printed car. Yes, everything that you see that's uh, orange is 3D printed. So shall we take a ride? Let's do it. Okay. All right, thank you very much. Jim Corr and his team of volunteers built the world's first 3D printed car on a shoestring budget in a garage. It's fragile. This is your first prototype. This is the very first prototype. How far are you from your second prototype? Uh, Three million dollars <laughs> <laughs> and about two years of effort. If 3D printed cars feel like a bit of a distant prospect, there are areas where the technology is already making inroads. What exactly here is 3D printed? I think most of what we see is 3D printed. Mm -hmm. We have orthopedic applications. We've got cranial applications. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah. So. Oh, you're going to pick it up. All right. Here we have. Uh, this is made from a, a CT scan of the patient. There's even one man printing stem cells. In the future, maybe organs. But the jury's still out on what the technology's impact will be for mass manufacturing. General Electric is jumping into the $2 billion market. Foxconn, the world's largest electronics manufacturer, calls it a gimmick. That's not a good look. One thing is for sure, 3D printing has a long road ahead. Ryan Chilcote, Bloomberg, London.